I think the comparison that needs to be drawn is with the ancillary copyright for press publishers that we discussed in the copyright directive from 2015 till 2019. And it's the same flawed idea that is based on a misunderstanding of the open internet. Um, back then, we didn't understand how links work. Now we don't understand that data that's sent to European networks is requested by paying internet customers people in Europe that are already paying to use that service. So and if we now want to introduce particular payment obligations, maybe be termination fees or price regulation in Interconnect, then what we ac actually doing is um, removing the one thing that keeps the market working, 